Hello food lovers, welcome to Peeply Fresh. My name is Anoop. Today I'm going to prepare a veg dish. I call this dish loaded tomato rice. It's vegan, it's gluten free, it's simple and it's delicious. And let's start cooking. So today's dish loaded tomato rice. So obviously we need loads of tomatoes, onion, broccoli, as usual ginger, garlic, chili, coriander or cilantro for garnish. Some cooked rice. Make sure you cook this rice in advance. I'm using some leftover rice, but if you are cooking, make sure you put that rice in fridge for an hour because when we stir it with tomatoes, if it's hot, it can get mushy. And also we need some turmeric and smoked paprika. Onions, you just roughly chop it. For tomato, I'm using normal tomato and some cherry tomato. So like onions, just roughly chop them tomatoes also. I used around two big tomatoes and at least five or six cherry tomatoes. Now broccoli, just uh, cut them broccoli flora. We want this dish colorful, so we want the redness of the tomatoes and the greenness from the broccoli. Do you use the broccoli stem? I usually chop off the hard part in other words, outer layer and use the inside. They are quite soft and uh, taste like I would say radish so I will keep them in my dish. Chilies. I don't usually slice them because the seeds are very, very, very spicy. I so I just like pop them in a few places. So when we cook them, they release the taste, but less spicier. And ginger and garlic, finely chopped. So I use uh, two cloves of garlic and a little bit of ginger here, and finally some coriander or cilantro. So now we put our wok in high heat, add 2 tablespoons of coconut oil, put your hand on top, if, it, if you can feel the heat, that means the oil is hot. That time, add the ginger garlic and the chili. Mix it. A little bit of cream to leave. Now the onions. And sweat the onion for a few minutes. And now you can smell the ginger garlic and coriander aroma. After a few minutes. Add the tomatoes. Our wok is still in high heat. We want to get rid of as much as uh, water from the tomatoes. This is the time to add salt. So I'm going to add one and a half teaspoon salt, half a teaspoon turmeric powder and one teaspoon smoked paprika. You can see the tomato is getting cooked and it's softer. Most of water is out and this time add the broccoli. We don't want to cook the broccoli too long because we don't we want to keep the green color of the broccoli. And finally add rice and mix well. And taste your dish if you want 
to add any more salt. It's perfect, so you can switch it off now. Our loaded tomato rice is ready. We can plate it up and uh, garnish with coriander. This is our simple loaded tomato rice within minutes. If you are watching this video on YouTube, consider subscribing. Give me a thumbs up. Share this video with your friends and family. And always give your suggestions in the comment box below. I quite like the tanginess from the tomato and the broccoli is still crunchy and uh, it tastes good.